I know they capping. They be acting like they want them for real. That is, they don't want them. They just talking. See it, man. Thirties. They just sitting in the garage, man. Perfect. You see them, man. I won the truck, and I just been sitting in here. Cause I put twenty fours on there, but these thirties for sale. Whoever won. I ain't playing, y'all. Got a whole nother set ready to go. Whole nother set. Twenty sixes. Five look. Dual boat pattern. Five by five. And five by five and a half. No cap. Dual boat pattern. Get in tune. What's poppin'? What's going on, y'all? Um, today we in the garage with it. I normally don't try and give y'all too many garage episodes, you know what I'm saying? But uh today I was out here cleaning this garage out, to be honest with you, and um Man, you know, it's only right that I just go ahead and document some of this shit and show y'all what's going on. So, um, y'all stay tuned. What's poppin'? It's KG Go Hard, and I'm back with another video. Y'all already know what y'all about to get, man. Tune in with your boy. It's about to go crazy. Be going up every day, and if you ain't like to subscribe, do so now, because it's about to jump. All right, y'all see it. That's what we got going on today, y'all. I got two sets of rims out here. You know what I'm saying? I got the Monty Forge wheels that came with this truck. You know what I'm saying? It came with salt and pepper. You feel me? I end up putting 24 inch snow, snowflakes on here. And I like the way it looked, man. I'm gonna be honest with y'all, man. So um, I got a couple ideas that I was thinking about doing to the truck that's gonna enhance the look. Um, but yeah, that's where we at with it, man. So it came with these wheels here. Um, since I took them off, they just been sitting in the garage and I haven't done much with them. You know what I'm saying? So I brought them out today. And uh, man, I don't know. I don't know, man. You know, I just cleaned them up. Had these ones out here, clean these up as well. These been sitting. Um, Y'all know I actually had another pair of rims too, uh, some 20s that I actually posted on my channel. Um, so we about to see um, what we gonna do with these because the 20s just sold. Now. Yeah, if you haven't already seen that video with the 20 inch rims I had where um, I actually cleaned them up, um, polish them real decent and package them up uh, for sale so that a person can come get them. I posted them um, just recently and the guy came through and got them, you know, drove two and a half hours to come get them. Um, they were the perfect rim for what he was trying to do and right on time for me to get the sale. So now I got these two sets of rims who've been sitting in the garage as well and I'm trying to figure out what do I do with them? These ones right here actually came with salt and pepper though, you know, I'm liking the way it look. I ain't gonna stunt, you know what I'm saying? I do got a few things that I feel like can, you know what I'm saying? But y'all just stay tuned. Y'all wait on it. Just just be cool for a second. Right now, we're dealing with these rims right here and what we're gonna do to these. Uh, some people aren't mad or some people don't agree with me um, taking the 30 inch rims off of the truck. These rims do not look bad. Um, some people say they don't look as good as the 30s. They look too small and stuff like that. But I don't think that this really looks bad, to be honest with you, man. Um, it's not really something that I rolled like this before. But for comfortability, it does do a great job due to the fact that I could take this car a lot farther um, on these wheels than I could on these wheels. Um, this, I don't mind driving this locally. But jumping on the expressway daily and getting to certain places um on time and stuff like that you got to be careful when you ride rims this big um especially ones that cost you know what i'm saying because once you mess this rim up you got to replace it or buy another one 
and it's just a, a pain that you don't want to have to go through because they got potholes everywhere so these are the wheels um i have a lot of people who've been in my inbox a lot of people hit me on instagram a lot of people hit me on snapchat a lot of people hit me on facebook and they all talk to me about these rims ever since i've taken them off of this truck and everybody's seen these rims on here you know what i'm saying so now they want to know what i'm going to do with these i have not been entertaining any of the offers that people have been giving me for these wheels because i feel like they all cap every single one of them is all cap I don't think nobody want them for real because if it's something that I want, I know how to go about purchasing it, whether it's for sale or not. You know what I'm saying? But um, I'm doing this video to let y'all see the wheels and the condition that they in and how they was when I received them. I haven't ridden them much. You know, I've been doing YouTube for five months. Um, it's all been documented. Y'all see what the product's been. I've been documenting almost everything. So y'all see the wheel, man. Um, and I'm going to say that I actually posted the rims for sale. Um, and we're going to see how this turn out, man. We're going to see how it turn out, if anybody interested. Also, I got these right here, which are uh, 26s. These 26-inch rims have been sitting as well, um, and I don't know what to do with them. They actually are dual bolt pattern. I'll let y'all see that real quick. All of them got good tread. All of them hold air, and they dual bolt pattern. They have two bolt patterns on here. One is 5x5, five five, and the other is 5x5.5. Five five so you got two five lug bolt patterns on these rims. Like I said, they all got good tread. Oh, all the center caps are there. All four rims, all of them have the tire tube thing on there. Yep, they go to size. 305, 30, 26s, y'all. Y'all see it. So I'm really debating on what I want to do with these rims as well. I'm not sure. Really not sure. Um, these are used rims. They are not perfect. This rim right here does have a slight discoloration on the cap, but it's nothing major. I mean, y'all can see clear as day that it's not really that big a deal. I'm just being 100 with y'all about what I got going on. That's it. 26s though um the bolt pattern doesn't match um the cars that i have here so i haven't done anything with it i was actually looking for another vehicle to bring to the channel that i could actually um bolt these rims up to but the, it, it's been kind of hard finding the right fit on top of i really don't have the space for a vehicle but i have the interest in a vehicle if you feel what i'm saying and uh, i will say these tires have been just uh, just been sprayed that's why they look wet like that you know what I'm saying? I just got done taking care of that business right here. Um, I actually did a video not too long ago where I got this can right here for like a dollar. You know what I'm saying? Almost free. So if y'all guys want to um, learn how to save money and get stuff like this that you're going to never, ever have too much of, y'all make sure y'all watch that video. But uh, this is where we at with it, man. That's where we at with it. I'm going to show y'all the back of this rim, too, so y'all can see what's going on. These things is heavy. Y'all see the tread all holding air. Boom. Y'all see it, man. This thing like new. Like new. Mind you, I haven't really did no excess cleaning or nothing. You know what I'm saying? Just a wipe down. And a little, little tire shine. Nothing major. But y'all see it, man. Y'all get in the comment section and let me know what y'all think. I come across rims and stuff like this all the time. I'm actually interested in um, doing possibly a raffle. You know what I'm saying? On um, one of these, if not both of these, or other rims and other things I come across in the future. I just want to know who all willing to participate. You know, some of the raffles going on by some of the people, um, you know, been giving it a bad name. You know, but I'm a stand-up dude. You know what I'm saying? I've been documenting my character for the most part on YouTube. Um, if you met me in person, you know what I'm saying? You can gauge um what type of person i am based on that but i'm just being honest with y'all man you know what i'm saying like i have stuff i've always sold it i'm a person who has things and i sell them i don't get too attached to most things though you know what i'm saying they are for sale the right price can almost buy any um property you know what i'm saying i'm not too attached to those things though like they come and they go but um y'all get in the comment section and let me know what y'all thinking about these wheels man what should i do you know what i'm saying it's not just my channel it's yours as well so y'all let me know what y'all want to do man I don't know. 
Um, I'm gonna keep y'all posted as far as, like I said, I did post these wheels and I'm gonna see if I get any traction. Um, it's been a lot of plan um, in my inbox. You know what I'm saying? It's been a lot of interest showed, but not enough action. Um, and I did this right here though, just to show people I wasn't playing. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people actually had something to say about the 30s, but when I took them off, you know what I'm saying? It, it's easy now. Y'all want the rims, come get them. But they don't want them. You know what I'm saying? They just rather, they want to count my pockets. They want to see if I'm fucked up. They want to see, you know what I'm saying? What I'll take, what's my bottom dollar? You know what I'm saying? And that's, that's stupid. That's stupid. So right now, this is not to address those people. This right here is to address the people who really see something that they might want. This is to address the people who actually interested in the channel. This is to address the people who actually um, feel a certain way about the 30s being on this truck because I'm actually putting it out there that it's a chance that these rims could be gone um, sooner than later. And I just wanted to get in front of that and let you guys know what was going on with it. You know, um, this channel is actually bigger than this truck. The truck still, this truck is still here. You know what I mean? The rims are still here, but this channel will be here for a long time. I can't tell you that this truck is going to be here the remainder of this channel. It could or it could not be. I don't know. It's all about growth and, you know what I'm saying, elevation on this channel. And I feel like if I'm not growing or elevating, certain things need to change. So, um, no pressure, no need to panic. Um, if you guys are interested in either of these two wheels, you hit me on Instagram. Um, that's KG underscore uh, go underscore hard. Um, also have a TikTok as well. You guys can hit me there. Check out some of my TikToks. Um, that's KG underscore go underscore hard. Same as uh, TikTok. And I posted these rims on my Snapchat. You know what I'm saying? Real quick, just to see if I can get some traction. And my TikTok is KG. 2021 so all those things um exist if you haven't already followed me or check me out on those things please do so and there will be more to come to this channel very much more very much more hope you guys been enjoying the content that i've been dropping lately and for those of you um who haven't y'all just stay tuned and actually get in the comment section and give me some suggestions you know what i mean give me some things that you think that i could bring into the channel that can make it more enjoyable for you and for those who watch you know, y'all let me know, but there's so much more to come. I promise. And with that being said, peace. You are now